disappointed were you with the defending of your team tonight? But, uh, uh, for sure, uh, we have to be disappointed, no? Disappointed because uh, um, after a first start uh, where we struggle a lot, and I think uh, uh, they were good, but I think that uh, uh, we made many, many mistakes, many mistakes, especially in uh, with the ball. And uh, I think uh, this type of situation creates a bit of instability, no mental instability in uh, in my team, especially in the first half, because in the second half, then uh, we started game to play. Uh, uh, we we started to press in the right way and uh, uh, didn't change anything uh, compared to the first half. And uh, <laughs> In the second half, we and then we created a chance to score, and uh, but also in the first half because uh, every time we played the ball in the right way, we created a situation to to go to score. But I repeat, we made many mistakes in the first half and uh, uh, important mistakes. And uh, in the second half, uh, mm, we did well, we scored, and then uh, yeah, you had to be more good uh, to defend because I have seen the two goals and we considered two goals uh, uh, with uh, uh, the defensive line uh, that stay there and uh, you have to be more accurate but I know very well that uh, I repeat in this season uh, uh, we are going uh, to, to struggle to get three points and uh, uh, I said this uh, uh, before. I continue to repeat, and uh, for sure, I think that now we are we are, we are improving in many aspects. But then, uh, we are still uh, too emotionally. And uh, I guess later we won a three-two, and we were losing two-one. Today we were winning two, two-one, and we lost the three-three-one. I think. Uh, on this aspect, we have to improve because uh, if we want to to grow as a team uh, and to try, you know, to 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 be competitive, and uh, the first thing that you have to improve and uh, to be uh, stability, stability, not up and down, up and down, up and down, and I think that uh, uh, this is a situation that uh, we have to to improve and. Uh, uh, yeah. Also, I repeat, uh, in a team, it's important also to have uh, players with experience and to manage the situation uh, in uh, and during the game. And, uh, yeah, but uh, I repeat, it was a pity because uh, my players uh, they uh, they gave uh, 120 percent today, yeah, and the effort was uh, maximum. I can tell that uh, I cannot tell that. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't see uh, right attitude. I don't see. I didn't see uh, right commitment. Uh, I have seen a maximum commitment, and uh, for this reason, uh, we have to try to. Yeah, and to try to. Uh, to avoid uh, this defeat, because I think uh, today uh, we could avoid this uh, this defeat, especially when uh, you go to one and uh, there are uh, 50 minutes, 20 minutes to to play. We have to try to manage the, the situation in a in a better way. But and uh, it happened, and uh, we had to to take experience about this uh, this game and to try to to improve. Thanks, Ali. Uh, Jack Pitbrook, please. Hi, Antonio. Why do you think your team struggled so much against Southampton's pressing, especially in the first half? It's a problem that Tottenham have a lot. Yeah, but in the, I think I think in the first half that uh, uh, we have struggled a lot on the 
uh, the situation uh, uh, to to put to, to put pressure was the same. Eh? The first half, like like the second half, and the first half, uh, I think that uh, uh, we were uh, not so. Uh, mm, I don't know, but. Uh, I don't. I don't know why. I think, in my opinion, that in the first half we made many, many mistakes with the ball, and this created problem also without the ball. Because when when you, you lose confidence, you lose confidence in every aspect, and with the ball and without the ball. Then after the first and second half, I spoke with them and I said, okay, and uh, football, uh, you can make a mistake, but then you have to play a game. Otherwise, uh, uh, when uh, when you make a mistake and then you go down and uh, you don't want to play, you don't want to press, you don't want to run to protect yourself, and uh, uh, <laughs> we are we are in trouble. I think it happened this because in the second half I asked them to be brave, to to have courage, and uh, with the ball, without the ball, and I think uh, we played a good second half. Until the goal, then we considered two goals that for sure we uh, we could avoid because uh, uh, we were with the uh, with the defensive line in the in the position uh, and uh, yeah. But this uh, I repeat, this is a part of process and uh, I'm repeating uh, always the same thing and. Uh, Get two points. We have to struggle. We have to struggle and to give uh, 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 every every game 120 percent. And I repeat, today the effort was maximum. I can't not to tell you that my players, the effort was not good, the committee was not good. No, and I have to tell thanks to my players because the committee was top. But then uh, you know that. Uh, we have to improve in many many aspects, and uh, we have a long a long road in front of us. And Charlie Ecoche, please. Hi, Antonio. You mentioned there a couple of times about the defensive line and having to be more accurate. What do you put those goals down to? Then is that a collective failing? Is that individuals not being where they should be? But, um, but for for sure uh, you attack with uh, with ten players and uh, you defend with uh, with ten players and uh, when happen when you consider the goal oh um, um, there is a kick uh, and uh, in uh, the top top uh, angle okay and then uh, uh, you can only clap no your uh, um, your opponent. Otherwise, uh, and uh, in every goal, uh, there are uh, situations that you can improve. And I, I think, uh, but it's normal when you consider three goals, and for sure, uh, we scored uh, we scored two goals, and in the goal that uh, we scored, uh, and uh, there are situations that Southampton, Southampton can improve. And, uh, uh, yeah, but I repeat. Uh, we have way to to work and to know that uh, our season will be tough. It will be tough. We have to know this. And uh, but I'm pleased that I repeat for the effort for the commitment of my players. I ask them to have always uh, personality, no? good personality. And then uh, during the game you can make mistakes, but we have to try to reduce, no, and uh, um, mistakes and uh, and uh, to improve in other aspects. Okay, thanks guys, we'll leave it there. Thank, thank you. Thank you very much.